contentment. How do you get it? Gonna talk about it next on Pastor Bob's Coffee Break. There's an old song by the Mamas and the Papas called California Dreamin'. And it says, all the leaves are brown and the sky is gray. Yeah, it's one of those days, except I'm not California Dreamin'. I love this kind of weather. It's autumn, it's brisk, feels great. Love this, just right after a rain last night and it's a beautiful morning here in Tennessee. My kind of day, actually, I like this. So, great question for today. Dear Pastor Bob, how do you get to the place of inner contentment in your spiritual life? I've been a Christian for 12 years and I'm still trying to find it. Well, I don't think I've ever found a place of contentment necessarily in my spiritual life, my ability to do it. My contentment rests in Jesus Christ, who is able and stable. I'm not. And I think if I'm looking for me to improve, for in my own way, for me to find like inner peace, contentment without totally putting him at the foundation of it, I'm on the wrong course. See what I'm saying? Folks, I think it's so important that we get to the place of, of inner uh, contentment through relying on Jesus Christ as the source of contentment. Now you say, well, that's kind of reaching, but it's really not. I can either pursue contentment and try to be enlightened and try to feel better about myself and all of those things and trying to feel more stable in the world around me. But that doesn't really get you anywhere because it's unstable. There's not a lot of contentment around. And my inner peace, well, I don't have any without Jesus. So when you look at contentment, that's really where it begins. I want to look today at First Timothy chapter 6 and verse 6, and it says, but godliness actually is a source of great gain when accompanied by contentment. That contentment which comes from a sense of inner confidence based on the sufficiency of God. See what he did there? <laughs> based on the sufficiency of God. In other words, my contentment isn't in me, it's in him. You know, people spend their whole lives trying to find inner peace, trying to find contentment, trying to find all of these things on their own without Christ. Or some Christians even try to find it apart from Christ. I, I should feel good about myself every day. No, you really shouldn't because <laughs> there's a whole lot of things about you that you shouldn't feel good about. But my faith, my source, is based on nothing less than Jesus Christ and his righteousness. That's what the old hymn says. But folks, that's very important to hear my chimes going off. Love that sound. Contentment. Do you have it today? Again, you get it. It's a source of great gain, the Bible says, when, uh, when you have godliness and you use contentment as the foundation, or foundation of contentment on godliness. That sense of inner confidence based on the sufficiency of God. He's able. He is our foundation. He is our rock. And when we put our total faith and our need for contentment on him, that's where we find it, only in him. 
Hope that helps today. Folks, don't forget, you are blessed. So go and be a blessing.